Hey guys, it's Nadim, aka Sports Car, and welcome to my channel. So for this tutorial, we are going to be talking about how to rig a car in under five minutes, like like around five minutes. But yeah, so for this rig, it has um, wheel rotation. Um, wheel turning, um, um, the body movement, and most importantly, um, the drift. So let's get straight to this. By the way, guys, um, before we start, uh, first we have to download the add-on for the rigger car. So I'll just go to code and download zip. And then you just go to the add-on, install, and then just find it in your desktop. Alright, so for this tutorial, we are going to be rigging this Lamborghini SVJ, I mean SV. So before this 5 minute starts, um, alright, so before we start anything, let's just make sure that, um, that the monkey is facing the right way. Nope, that means we have to rotate the car. Just like that, nice. Alright, so let's start. So. Um, so bring the empty, use the plane axis, make sure to transparent um, like that to all the car and apply all transforms, go here, apply all transform, all right, and then we have to give this a name, so I'm going to call this Lambo um, dot body, and you guys have to use the exact, um, you guys have to use the exact name. Don't change the body, just change the name of the car but not the body. So just leave this one here and yeah. All right, so just copy the exact same thing of what I did. So let's go here, Shift S, cursor to selected. Then you add um, a plane axis. You do the same thing to the other. Now you do the same thing to the other wheel. So once you did um, all the wheel sides, it should be like this. It should have those plane axes on all sides, of course. Now we, we are going to give them a name. So let's start over here. And you guys have to copy the exact same thing of what I typed. So I'm going to rename this. Um, let's go to the notes. Um, yeah, so here it is. So, copy and paste. I'll put this link in the description so you guys can copy and paste it. Or you guys can just type it. So, I'm, I'm going to copy this. And paste it right in here because this is the left wheel. And you guys can name this car, but leave these. Just leave these parts. Now we're gonna do for this wheel. Copy and rename it. Uh, rename it and paste it. And this is the right wheel. So yeah. Now for the back, we're just gonna copy and paste um, this one. No, yeah, that one. So this is the right wheel, name it, um, yeah, but just to keep in mind, just type the exact same thing. You can change the name, but just leave these, so yeah. All right, so for the left wheel, um, in the, in the notes, uh, copy this and paste it right Oh shoot, paste it right here, there. Right, so the next step is to do for the brake calipers. So this part right here, I'm going to rename it. Uh, let's see. So just copy this. It's just like the same um, script. So 
and boom. And then move the same side and boom. Just like that. And we just need to transparent the wheels. So use this. First we need so what I do, okay, so what I do is I would unhide. I mean yeah, hide these. And then I would unhide and select this and then transparent. I'll do the same thing as this. Hide, hide, hide. Alt. Object key transform. Hide, hide. And hide that one. Because this is the front wheel, so you gotta hide the front caliper or the front brake. And hide. And I would also hide this because it's also the front wheel. So, yeah, just try to follow along. <laughs> I unhide and um, transform with this. <clears throat> so, once you did all of this, um, shift S, coarser to world origin, and then basically just transparent all of this to on the middle plane axis. So now it should be look like this. All right, so after that, you do it like this. All right, select all of them and the most active one should be in the middle plane axis. Shift A, um, go to the armature and go to the car de deformation rig. Click N, go to the rigger car tab and generate. And for the wheels um, rotation, put it on one so the wheels can move. All right, you're basically done. Now you have a car rig. Um, you know, easy. And that's pretty much it. So for the next tutorial, I'm going to be animating this car. It's going to be a short car animation so stay tuned for that and make sure to follow me on the instagram and um, yeah see you